Hey guys, it's Lillian from the Book Coven podcast and here today going through our tarot and oracle decks for you, letting you know what we like about them, what we don't like about them, and where you can get them. So this deck is the Starseed Oracle deck, I'll show you over here. It is by Rebecca Campbell and artwork Danielle Noel. This one I got on Amazon, but you can get Amazon, Etsy, it's a very accessible deck. Um, the deck itself is super cool, look at this shit. It's triangular. <laughs> How many triangular boxes do you get? It's a really neat, compact uh, deck. I purchased this one because the art is phenomenal. I mean, look at this shit. It's really colorful, even the back is really blue, pink, pastel colors, which was different from my other decks, which are usually very dark and spooky. Um, act like reading it, this is not my go-to deck because it's a little difficult for me to relate to. Personally, it's very out there, the way she describes the car. She has a guidebook here. It's, um, like, if you don't know much about star seeds and that stuff, I don't, I don't know if I would get this one for you, but, I mean, like, I really just focus on the card and the, what it says here. I, I try not to go into the guidebook that much. It's a good size oracle. I, I do like that oracle cards are bigger than tarot cards. I'm not great at shuffling them. This one I find it's really easy to shuffle, really smooth. And Jesus Christ, my team here is being... <laughs> Ridiculous. It's a real thick boy. Look at it. Look at this flip. Didn't even crease. Boom. You, you can get real violent with these cards. They're not gonna budge. Here's another. You're not for everyone. Oh, it's weird. I, I, pulled, I pulled this card all the fucking time. And it just pulled it again. Yeah, so some of, a few of these cards I can really relate to, but it's just very... Not, yeah, I don't know. Not preachy. It's just... It's tough. To, when If you read the guidebook, for me, I try to avoid the guidebook and just go with instinct what the image on the card, how I can relate to it, because the guidebook is too much for me. But it's a beautiful deck, uh, very easy to find, and, even, and the spreads that they have, they use the box. They somehow like incorporate... I can't figure it out right now. I've had alcohol, but you can like make weird... Um, you can do like shit like that, and it makes a spread. You'll see in the guidebook. Anyways, I've been Lillian, and this has been the Starseed Oracle. So, thanks for watching, thanks for listening. Tune in to our regular podcast. And yeah. Mmm.